assalamu alaikum welcome back now we will be talking about what is a state table before this you have covered what is a state equation and you have solved an example of sequential circuit and derived the state equations for that circuit so again i am going to give that example here because state equation topic is always followed by a state table okay so <clears throat> what is a state table actually before this you have covered what is a truth table any combinational logic circuits which actually maps all combinations of inputs to the outputs but in the sequential logic circuit we also need to map the inputs outputs in the flip flop states because these are also important things to consider this kind of table has four sections to consider the first one is the present state which defines the state of the flip flop at the given time t then we have the second section input which has all the possible combination of inputs for the present states then we have the next states which is the function of the given inputs in the present states and finally we have the output which is the function of the given present state and given inputs so so let's go to the example previously discussed we have already developed the equation for this example which was a of t plus 1 is the function of a of t and to x of t plus b of t and to x of t similarly b of t plus 1 is equal to Uh, sorry it was equal to a let me revert back okay the function of a dash of t and x of t and the output was a function of a of t plus b of t into x dash of t so these were the state equations now if we apply different inputs to these state equations and outputs we will get all possible combination of state inputs and outputs so here the, this is the state table for this example we know that we have the present state a and b and the input 0 and 1 so we need to consider the present state 0 0 for input 0 and 1 then we need to consider 0 1 for inputs 0 and 1 then again we need to consider the for the states 1 0 for the inputs 0 and then 1 and finally for the states 1 1 we need to have all the possible combination of inputs which is 0 and 1 and with this we will put all these values in these equations and after that we can get the next states which is given by these values and finally we can put these values in the uh, this equation and we can find the output of this state table okay so this was all about the state table which uh, uh, enumerates or combines the inputs outputs and the flip flop states okay thank you